Hi, hello, welcome to Trubies, the most happening event in Hyderabad. The automobile EV uh, manufacturers are displaying their products. So let's go inside and check out what's new. Uh, here now we are with electric bus. So let us go inside and check out what are the new futures. So let us find out all the details about the bus now. Today now we have Mr. Venu Gopal Garu, uh, Vice President Sales and Marketing. Sir, can you please tell yeah. the details about the bus? Hi, this is Venu Gopal Rao. Uh, I am Vice President for Sales and Marketing for Electra. And uh, we are the India's first company to manufacture electric buses. And uh, we uh, thank you for the true biz to uh, take this bite. And uh, uh, the bus that we are, you are seeing is uh, intercity transportation bus. Normally, uh, a, a, most of the uh, cities have got electric buses in city drive, not in the intercity category. We are the first one to launch a full-fledged intercity bus with a luxury coach. This is called Electra CX2 as a bus number name. And Electra is a company based out of Hyderabad and we have a plant in Jadcharla which is about 70 kilometers from Hyderabad and uh, we are the India's uh, premium and uh, uh, first electric bus manufacturer and we have deployed our buses starting from 2015-16 in Himachal Pradesh, uh, Rotang Pass which is about 13,000 feet height and we are the manufacturers of these buses in uh, association technology partnership and also our buses uh, so far we have deployed about 1047 buses and we have order book of about 3600 buses and we are coming out with our uh, another plant uh, very soon and which will have about 10,000 buses and are uh, go, launching uh, electric tipper vehicles also. The, the uh, primary business model in India currently uh, is uh, more of uh, uh, GCC model. So it is basically GCC is grass cast contract where uh, transport authorities, smart cities, they uh, deploy the buses uh, for the electric mobility development and mobility development in their cities. So we as a company, we are into 360 degree ecosystem deployment company. We are the manufacturers of the bus and also we have our in-house operating company called EVA Transport and we also into electric charging infrastructure. We as a company deployed 1047 buses and about a 25 megawatt plus charging infrastructure with 450 charging units across country and still counting and about a 16 plus charging stations across country. We are basically if you look at as a charging and uh, uh, facility we are the one of the company which has got a huge huge uh, charging stations across all the transport hubs where we have our buses. For example, Pune we have deployed about 400 buses and in Mumbai we have deployed buses and we have an order book of uh, 2100 buses of Mumbai and we are also going to deploy these buses in Bangalore, Mysore for the KSRTC and Maharashtra Transport Corporation where these intercity transport luxury coaches are going to help citizens to travel between uh, city to their uh, destination in a comfortable, noise-free, pollution-free electric bus with the lowest cost possible in their travel. Sir, what about in Hyderabad, sir? Hyderabad, we have already deployed about 40 buses between uh, city to airport and these buses are going to be deployed very soon. Telangana Transport is in a final stage of uh, declaring the, announcing the uh, project. Maybe the, once they announce, we will be able to tell you more details. But KSRTC, MSRTLC, already it started. Sir, let us go inside and see all the features. Sir. So, sir, what is the difference between uh, diesel vehicle and uh, this electric vehicle, sir? Uh, driver's cabinet especially. Yeah, the, the, this electric bus is uh, uh, built with a lot of advanced technology mm -hmm. and it has got a special features if you see the camera. Yes, sir. And this yes. camera and uh, this is the camera which is uh, driver facing camera. Mm -hmm. And in this what happens is whenever the driver is driving the vehicle mm -hmm. and if he is drozed off or if he is... Uh, distracted with seeing something like this then immediately the camera will catch and make the siren oh, okay. so the driver will know that I am doing wrong mm -hmm. uh, even if a driver is taking the phone then immediately there will be indication oh. and also the, we have a central uh, monitoring system and which will monitor the buses running everywhere mm -hmm. 
so apart from uh, the the authority who will operate their own uh, buses and monitor we as a operator we do our own operations okay. and our own uh, operating system and central monitoring so system two ways operating will be yes there. yes and also this is a most advanced technology it is no clutch and no gear uh, product like suppose if you see today's uh, condition most of the buses driven by the uh, drivers are with a lot of gears and everything in city yes. or everywhere uh, some of the buses now new technology has come in diesel also but however this is going to be more of a painful for these drivers because of driving in a congestion bumper to bumper traffic but this does not have any clutch mm -hmm. okay and there is no gears okay. so this is uh, uh, driver is drive mode neutral and reverse okay and for the reverse there is a camera he can see what is happening yes. around yes sir. okay similarly like any advanced technology cars mm -hmm. and also full control and this is a announcement system where the driver can announce with the passenger communication mm -hmm. where he can announce saying that where he is and what is the moment like what it happens in the aircraft captain's announcing about the journey okay and also the entire information on the dashboard mm -hmm. is visible for the driver okay. so if you see this this is a battery indication okay here so we can see yeah it says that uh, you have a battery of 60% okay so based on the uh, particular this mm -hmm. how many kilometers it traveled That's and how much is the rift over it is visible here okay okay and what is the complete uh, ca the console will have various operationals okay which is convenient for any driver to operate the vehicle wow that's really great nice and nice uh, the entire camera and uh, both the sides mm. will communicate to the uh, rest of the world yeah. through the system which is kind uh, completely in control of the here, here yeah yeah, yeah so yeah. this is completely camera. in control of uh, uh, management okay. so nobody will have access to the camera mm -hmm. unless it is required and asked for it okay so normally the privacy is always maintained okay. and in the front two seats we have a, a specially designed uh, push back seats okay. and if you see the uh, headrest the yes. lot of time these buses travel for the longer distance of 3 to 5 km 5 okay. hours so the comfort of the passenger is taken care okay. and uh, as i mentioned these buses are going to be deployed in maharashtra and uh, uh, the mumbai and uh, pune and uh, bangalore okay so first phase and uh, passengers traveling between bangalore and uh, mysore will have these buses very soon okay. and this is going to be most advanced technology and uh, the hat track this is called hat track this is kind of a aircraft hat track model okay. where passengers will have a self uh, uh, managing of their uh, uh, needs okay. like there is a reading button yes. there is a but uh, light the, the, there is a reading button light and it can be moved according to the comfort of the driver yes here we can see this yeah side. and also there is another thing that is the light that is in the sides that is primarily used whenever they feel emergency okay. normally what happens in the night journey they need full light yes somebody needs half completely dark yes. so that can be monitored on their own uh, choice and the middle button red color button stop. this is called sos, SOS. it's okay. not stop it is sos okay. so nowadays most of the uh, authorities and uh, uh, cities have got a new system called sos okay. where it is connected to the local police okay so this so is direct ah uh, so police. that will be only activated when the city requires that okay the facility is provided and if required it can be activated okay here we can see yes, the spacious yes, seats yes. and the seat belts and here also we have usb port yeah, to connect like charging. we can we can charge Charity here here it is there are two ports which can be used for both the for both, both the, the yes and we have three emergency exit uh, here yes here there are one. two 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 exit uh, points here okay. emergency exit here is one rear side one and we have a door exit uh, okay, is there yeah, okay. yeah so there in the last we have uh, exit door there emergency exit door okay okay other and than the main the same door. thing same, same thing is in the back side back also side. yeah 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 okay. so what is the capacity of this bus sir this like is 45 plus driver uh, what what about the diesel vehicle is that the same the seating will be more or less same or little higher or little okay. lower okay. any bus will have a option okay. it all support for example this is actually 45 plus driver uh, capability okay. the capacity and uh, this particular client who is going to buy this bus he asked for a uh, 43 plus d okay. and he kept a uh, emergency exit uh, two seats to open space oh let us see sir let's yeah. go back and see the 
this is what so this is uh, this is the emergency exit, exit and the client wanted this to be open okay. so it, it they have their own plants it could be of a, a cafeteria kind of thing mm -hmm. or it could be of a space for exit emergency okay. and you have a emergency exit uh, hammer over there hammer, yes. and any time you require any yes. emergency they can break the glass and jump out of this okay and also here this is another emergency yeah. exit any anybody wanted they can climb from here to here to there, there. okay in any emergency Nice. And, uh, so total three emergency exits. Yes, and also three emergency exits and one main door. Main door, yes. And second thing is most of the rear seats are normally not comfortable. Yes. Sir. So when somebody wanted to uh, uh, book their ticket, they will try if I don't find a front seat or middle seat or rear seat except the last five lines, yes. five rows. Yes. But in this, they will be choosing once they have experience of the traveling, they will be preferring to that seat because that, that is the, the most, most comfortable. comfortable. Yes. Sir. And most important thing is the middle seat of the last rear, uh, rear uh, con complete row yes. lot of times so we have a problem yes. because when the break uh, when he is sleeping if a brake applied or anything he will jump on the front so yes. we have provided a seat belt yes. and we are also going to provide uh, the left side too also there will be a seat uh, belts coming up okay so here also we have yes uh, everywhere we have a two two ports uh, for the passengers to use and here, uh, another camera, camera. And uh, the rear that box is a display board where it communicates about a uh, travel, uh, where you are traveling and all that. Okay. Nice. Thank you, sir. Thanks welcome, for explaining Thank us you. all Thank the you. details about Thanks. this bus. Thanks for the group is for Thank promotion you. of electric mobility. And this is the time that Telangana, the biggest event. Yes, sir. And uh, this is the first event by the Telangana government in support of Telangana electric mobility industry. Telangana electric mobility users and Telangana electric mobility promotions and this is the first of its kind in India to have a demand generation event happening in Hyderabad. Wow. There are a lot of events which happen in uh, north side particularly in Delhi Ogaira. Those are the events primarily promotes uh, the uh, stakeholders like a manufacturer mm -hmm. or any interested professionals they walk in but here this event and this venue helps common people to come into this place and learn what is happening around yes. and what is the mobility how it works they like you have spoke to that kid yes. so that is the kind of a connect between users and the industry and the stakeholders of government and private yes. so that that surely helps and moreover uh, 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 the channels of your kind true base can also be the part of the promotion wherein it reaches to the masses Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. This is all about this Electra Mail Bus. I think so. Hope you have enjoyed this.